there is a whole world of colorful creative music out there, and these are the tools of the trade. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today, we're counting down our picks for the top 10 cool musical instruments. For this list, we're ranking musical instruments which either possess a notion of coolness or are the chosen instrument for a particularly cool musician. We're also taking into account how various artists have taken an instrument and utilized it in a particularly cool way and made it their own. Although we're omitting the marble machine, as there's only one known example of this instrument in the world. Number 10, Didgeridoo. It doesn't take long to pick out the sound of a didgeridoo from a musical crowd, thanks to its loud droning sound and uniquely elongated shape. This wind instrument was first introduced by Aboriginal Australians as a tool closely tied in with their tribal culture, with the didgeridoo continuing to be closely associated with the country's musical heritage to this very day. Progressive musicians such as Kate Bush and pop group Jamiroquai have even utilized the didgeridoo in a modern rock format, thus proving its versatility across culture and genre. Number 9, Harmonica. The next instrument on our list has long been the chosen sidearm accompaniment of bluesmen and folk heroes alike. Although this reed instrument, also known as a French harp or mouth organ, never really sees use as a song leader, its ability to drive home a memorable melody has proven useful for artists as varied as Bob Dylan and Billy Joel, whose classic Piano Man features a plaintive, melancholy harmonica in between the song's verses. It's portable, easy to learn, and the perfect instrument to pull out when you just want to lay down a jam. Keep me searching for a heart of gold. Number 8, Cello. Whoever said that the cellos couldn't rock? Don't spout such nonsense to Finland's Apocalyptica, who have made a career out of electrifying audiences with their heavy metal cello antics. Apocalyptica aren't the only artists to break new ground when it comes to these classy string instruments, however, as evidenced by the avant-garde alternative act Rasputina, who combine the cello's roots in beautiful classical music and combine it with a dark, fresh, and very cool sound all their own. Number 7, Violin. Sure, some might not think there's much coolness to be found within the humble violin, but one need only point out the infamous reputation of the classical outlaw Niccolo Paganini to uncover the true sinister origins behind this small stringed wonder. The Italian violinist and composer was rumored to have sold his soul to the devil in order to develop his demonically fast and precise fingering technique, while Paganini's amorous adventures with female admirers earned him gossip wherever he traveled. If you're not a fan of the traditional sound of the violin, you better believe there is an electric counterpart. Number 
Number six, bass guitar. We head next to the mighty rhythm section, where this lord of the low end holds down a steady beat to anchor any song. The bass guitar is a versatile instrument when placed in the proper hands, as it can hang back in the pocket or fly off the handle, depending on the musician's technique. The bass guitar is often seen as an instrument of groove, however, and saw some serious progression thanks to Paul McCartney of The Beatles, whose performance on the band's Come Together saw serious innovation in terms of the bass guitar finally stepping out of the shadows and into the spotlight. Come together. Number five, saxophone. Nothing says slinky and sexy quite like the sensuous saxophone. This woodwind instrument was particularly popular in the 1980s thanks to its prominent placement in such massive pop hits as George Michael's Careless Whisper and Billy Ocean's Caribbean Queen. Elsewhere, the saxophone was put to good use in both R&B and rock, not to mention the classic big band sound of its deeper toned cousin, the baritone sax. Even Lady Gaga got into some sax action with her hit The Edge of Glory, proving that this horn still has plenty of tooting to do. Number four, Synthesizer. The next instrument on our list also rose to some serious prominence in the 1980s, but began to see proper implementation in the 1970s progressive rock boom. The synthesizer revolutionized the electronic music field when it was utilized by such forward-thinking rock icons as Rush and Emerson, Lake, and Palmer, while former Yes keyboardist Rick Wakeman even drafted an entire concept album about King Arthur around the synthesizer. Meanwhile, Germany's Tangerine Dream managed to create entire worlds with the synthesizer's almost limitless potential for atmosphere and soundscapes. A notion which has been continued today with such modern electronic artists as Trent Reznor. Number three, piano. Blue jean baby, LA lady. The classics never go out of style, as evidenced by the longevity of the mighty piano. If you think this instrument is just for classical music or soft teary ballads, then think again, because the piano has long been a cornerstone in the gigantic castle wall which is rock and roll history. Oh, how it feels so real. the classical bombast of Mozart, Stevie Wonder's electrified funk, or the formative rock of Jerry Lee Lewis, few instruments have driven as many musicians to coolness as the piano. Want further proof? Just watch Tori Amos tinkle those ivories, and be convinced that the piano is one massively cool instrument indeed. <laughs> Number two, drums.
Everybody loves the drums, even your neighbors. There's just something primal and propulsive about this ultimate rhythmic instrument which makes it an icon of cool. Drums can be loud and boisterous or dizzyingly technical, but one thing's for sure, they're a profoundly physical instrument which demands a lifetime of dedication and dexterity to master. Fans may love to air guitar their favorite licks at concerts, but air drumming has to land a close second, as evidenced by the legions of Neil Peart fans who flock to every Rush concert for yet another glimpse of their drum god and rock icon. Before we reveal our coolest musical instrument, here are a few rockin' honorable mentions. Number 1. Electric Guitar There have been countless stories of rock and roll icons who grew up idolizing their favorite guitarists. It didn't matter if that guitarist was Eddie Van Halen, <laughs> Lindsey Buckingham, or Annie DeFranco. It was the allure and siren call of that seductive six string which brought them all together. The guitar is cool enough on its own, but the addition of plugging it into an amp and cranking it to 11 just set the bar so much higher. Endlessly expressive, capable of an array of styles, tones and sounds, and able to fit into any musical genre, the electric guitar is a go-to tool of creation, and there's nothing cooler than that. So, do you agree with our list? Which instrument do you think is the epitome of cool? For more harmonious top 10s published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com.